Good afternoon. I'm David Sears with the KSAT 12 News Update. We are learning the name of a man killed outside of a bar on the southwest side of town. This was the scene late Sunday night at Morales Ice House on Frio City Road. That's near Highway 90 and South Calavera Street. The Bear County Medical Examiner says 51 year old Felipe Pena was shot in the parking lot outside of that bar. Somehow he was able to make it back inside before he died. We're told officers arrested a suspect in another part of the city. We are also learning a man has died from his injuries following a hit and run on the west side. This happened around 9 last night on Castroville Road and South General McMullen Drive. Police say the man was hit by the driver of a white car that took off. Another driver in a dark colored vehicle was unable to avoid running over the mech. But police say that driver pulled over to call for help. EMS tried to help, but he died at the scene. Happening right now, the murder trial of Leopoldo Mora continues. He is accused of killing Kenneth Salazar back in 2021 at a local motel. If found guilty, Mora is facing five to 99 years or life in prison. Court reporter Erica Hernandez tells us the trial is continuing this afternoon. The lead detective was on the stand this morning talking about the investigation and what led to the arrest. Eric will have more on his testimony on KSAT 12 News at 6. The Spurs will mount up for their last ride of the rodeo road trip tonight. So far, they have been bucked off eight times. They have never gone over on the rodeo road trip. They play in Utah against the Jazz tonight again. Utah beat the Spurs Saturday, 118 to 102. Heading San Antonio, it's 16th straight loss, a franchise record. The Spurs led the Jazz by 10 at halftime and then were outscored 30-14 in the third quarter. Those 14 points are a low for the Spurs in a quarter this season. Hopefully they can turn things around and get a rodeo road trip win tonight before they come home. We'll see you later.